she would talk about life and her sense of adventure on this Tumblr. Elisa ended up attending the University of British Columbia. However, after attending for a little bit of time, the schoolwork was quite
she should be. So that could explain why she was acting very odd in the elevator. They believed that she was most likely having a manic episode and hallucinating. So after the footage from the elevator is released, people begin to complain about the water pressure at the Cecil Hotel. Some of the guests are saying that there is no water pressure at all, and others complain of their water being black and having a very terrible odor to it. So, on February the 19th, the hotel worker named Santiago Lopez goes up to check the water tanks that are on the roof of the Cecil Hotel. After getting up there and climbing up, he opens the lid and sadly inside finds the deceased body of Elisa Lamb. Of course, police come out and investigate and they claim that Elisa Lamb passed away basically by climbing into the water tank on her own it was considered death, basically by way of bipolar disorder. So, this kind of threw the internet into a frenzy, and a lot of internet sleuths, as you would say, claimed that Elisa had been murdered. She had been placed in there because how would she be able to reach that water tank on the roof? And also, how would Elisa uh, know that it was even up there? Little things like that. So, previously, I believed that possibly some sort of foul play involved. The police reported that when Santiago had found Elisa's remains, that the lid on the water tank had been closed. This would have been extremely, extremely difficult for someone close after themselves. It was a very heavy lid, and that truly made me believe that foul play was involved of some sorts. However, after watching the documentary on Netflix, I found that the lid was actually open on the water tank. When Santiago found the remains, there was just a miscommunication. So this truly shifted the story for me. I do believe that Elisa was having a manic episode as no one else has ever been scene, you know, in that elevator footage with her. Uh, she wasn't taking her medications, and, you know, if she's hallucinating and believing someone is chasing after her, she could have reached the water tanks on the roof. The Cecil Hotel, there was roof access an alarm, you could also reach it by going out of a 
she thought. 